that, um, that a person who um, rents machines, a person who buys machines, has a responsibility for destroying or arranging for the destruction of records on a digital copy machine. In our offices, we rent machines, machines are rented to us, and we just always assume that everything is nice and clear and safe. Um, obviously, that assumption is uh, Statistics show that about 9 million people a year in America um, are victims of identity theft, and I think that there's no crime that's worse in terms of um, your life really being destroyed. And this is just a new method. I mean, when we get rid of computers, many of us do think of taking a hard drive out. We now have to think in terms of these machines when they go from office to office. What we learn from all this material is that there is a $500 fix that a particular company has, and I'm sure other companies have. Um, that's not very expensive. Everybody should be responsible for making sure these machines are clean before they go on to the next consumer. It's our intention to push this bill as quickly as we can. We're hoping for a fall passage because obviously you have to go through the various committees. Uh, we do think the potential threat to New Jersey citizens is enormous. Uh, I'm a lawyer. We do a lot of real estate transactions and I think about every time I use, I now think, every time I use that copier or that fax machine that I have to be absolutely certain that when the owner of the copier, and the owner, we lease a copier, it's a big copier, that when the, the copier is returned at, at the end of two or three years, at the end of the lease, that I have to be assured and shown that the copier and my fax machine has been washed. Because you think about the liability. Mm -hmm. And I, I would be in that, in that chain of liability.